Good morning. Sunday morning. Happy Sunday. Welcome to Education and welcome to another episode of You Laugh, You Lose. If you are new to this channel and new to this series, the game is simple. If you laugh, you lose, you do a punishment. What is today's punishment? Today's punishment is if you laugh, you lose, and you have to enter the next hobby horse competition nearest you, wherever that is. And if there isn't one within a thousand miles, you have to start your own and invite all your friends and family. That's what you gotta do. I still, I can't believe this is a real thing just while we're on this. Anyways, you have to do that. If you accept the terms of today's game, head down and like this video. And if you are new here, please make sure you are subscribed and have the bell clicked for notifications when new videos are uploaded. Now on to today's game. If you laugh, you lose, go. Women calling Lizzo beautiful and inspiring. Women, when you tell them they look like Lizzo. You guys have been following this whole thing where she just got canceled like last week or two weeks ago because she fat shamed her own crew. That's a real story that happened. So <laughs> that mother effer back there is not real. <laughs> you guys see that one? Look at that. That bear allegedly is real over in China. I, I think it is real. Um, but it, it looks like a costume right there. Kind of like goes to a restaurant that only offers QR code menu. Me try that in a small town. See, this is what the song is about. It's about that crap. Putting QR codes as your menu. What if I have a flip phone? What if I don't have the ability to use a QR code? Huh? What about those people? Try that in a small town. It's true. Stop doing that stupid stuff. My pronouns are they, them. They, them? I'm doubling your rent. <laughs> hey. Hey. Hey, that's they, them discrimination, guys. Who left this on my car in Law 20? I just want to talk. Many three-year-olds have trouble staying within the lines. Maybe if you practice coloring this turtle, it will help you parking. <laughs> We should create like a little kit. You get 10 of these slips whenever you go to the store. Just keep them in your glove box. If you see an idiot parking, leave this under the windshield wiper. A lot of people need to know. We can't let all this idiocracy run around without being checked. We got to let people know when they're being dumb. So me looking through my meme archive for the perfect reaction pick instead of expressing my emotions in a healthy, communicative way. <laughs> if you do this, I love you. God bless you. You're a meme lord. Um, continue doing this. Don't ever respond with a serious emotional response. Don't do that. Use memes. Use gifts. Come on. I got an, I emailed you three days ago message this morning. Friday afternoon at 447, this person emailed me. They followed up at 815 this morning. 28 minutes. They emailed me 28 working minutes ago. Bye. <laughs> the worst type of people. Emailed on a Friday afternoon, Friday evening, damn near. And then message back Monday morning, like, why aren't you getting, fixing my order, my demand? Urgh. Yeah, I know. Now I'm going to wait another week because screw you. 90s me waiting for commercials to end. 2023 me waiting four seconds to skip a YouTube ad. I don't know why, but this is the worst. And I get it. You probably watched a couple ads already on this video. It's the only way we make money on this channel. So I apologize. Um, but I, I feel your pain. Maybe it's because you don't expect it. Like it just kind of pops up and then you got to wait the four seconds or whatever. When you're watching regular TV in the 90s, you know the commercials are coming. But those were bad too because they put them at the worst times. Like right on the cliffhanger. So you stuck around. And then when you stuck around on the reality shows, like it was always a nothing burger. They still do that. Like uh, what's the gold show? It's like, whoa, whoa, we're going to find the gold. We're going to crash the truck. Then they come back from commercial and neither of those things ever happen. The four horsemen of stuff you eat when you're standing with the fridge open trying to decide what to eat. Number one, definitely shredded cheese. Then a pickle, a dill pickle, not that freaking sweet crap wrapped in ham. Olives, eh. Eh, I don't know, man. Like, I've never, I never just sit there and eat olives out of a jar. It's kind of gross. In Outback, pulling an Outback parked... Outback, out and outback. Bottom ting. Gotta love those outback enthusiasts, man. They're hardcore. Architect. 
This wall is blank. Add some interesting feature. Intern. Yes, sir. Modern architecture, man. Very bizarre right there. What the hell? I want to know if anyone ever uses that, why that is there. Croc enthusiasts can now buy mini Crocs that attach to their regular size Crocs so that they can wear more Crocs. Start the rupture. <laughs> Sign of end times, man. Wearing Crocs on your Crocs so you can wear more Crocs. We have, we have a Croc epidemic at this point. If you guys watch the other show, um, yes, I'm going to get the dress shoes, the Croc dress shoes. It's happening. Trippy to think about, but if the pandemic never happened, Chipotle would never have installed the free shelf. <laughs> it's, dude, it's really weird. Like, you can just walk in there and grab something and go. I'm sure it happens all the time. It has to. Like, it has to happen all the time. Just go in there and grab the heaviest bag and leave. It's probably, it happens all the time, I bet. Do, does anyone here work at Chipotle? Does that happen? Can you let us know in the comments? Me leaving the dirty pan in the sink because, quote, it needs to soak. We haven't been over this philosophical talking points for months on this channel. And don't, don't be a dish soaker, man. There's dish soakers and dish washers. Wash the dish and get the work done. Quit being lazy. Guy did his own battery. Won't start. Oh, no. Oh. <sighs> Mechanics out there, I bet you guys see the craziest stuff. Listen. <laughs> really, man? Oh, you shouldn't be driving if you're this stupid. Freedom ain't free. It's two for six dollars. Oh, hell to the yeah. But I know that's fake. That ain't two for six. Are you that desperate? Oh, look at that. Someone freaking. It's his, oh, it's a meme. Ha ha. Kurger can't bing. <laughs> yeah, this is what? Ten years ago, maybe? Right now, that's probably like two for 20. I'm not even joking. Prices are out of control for food still. Bionomics, man. Come on, man. This summer's air quality be like bingos in the 80s. Mmm. Mm -mm, look at that. That's some tasty air out there full of uh, cowboy killer smoke. Yeah, granny's dobbing away, smoking away. It's like us huffing the Canadian wildfire smoke this year. How do you interact with someone who still wears a face? <laughs> React however you want, guys. <laughs> That's hilarious. Come on. I often daydream about winning the Powerball and buying the licensing rights to friends just to edit out the laugh tracks, then releasing it back to the public for free so everyone can finally understand how uneffing funny that crappy show actually is. <sighs> if any of you win the Powerball, can this like be on your list? That can't be that expensive. Like a fraction of what you're going to win. Let's do this for the laugh, ma'am. Or the lack thereof. I can't wait to teach you how to ignore pronouns. <laughs> That's great parenting right there. South African man arrested for eating at KFC free for a year by saying head office sent him to taste if they are up to standard. Free him. <laughs> Dude, just like uh, Chipotle. If there's a way to take advantage of the system, somebody will. There are people out there that will take advantage of something. It, it just is what it is. It, it will always exist, no matter what. I don't have a welcome mat at my house because I'm not a liar. Damn straight. There's not a welcome welcome home sign because this ain't your home and you don't belong. Don't knock on the door. Don't do any of that. Unless you call beforehand. The official sports drink of the 90s. That Capri Sun, those little barrels. We've been over this. The Sunny D was in there. Throw that Tang. Do you guys remember Tang? You guys remember that? Huh? Whatever happened to that, by the way? Why is that? Why did that cease to exist? I cannot believe I am from a generation who paid for ringtones. This little rectangle made a single sound these days. I'd smash it. Oh, yeah. You keep that phone on silent and do not disturb. We did. It was cool. You could have ringback tones. Like when someone called you, a freaking Metallica song played. It was unbelievable. Like, the technology then was way cooler than it is now. It, it truly is. Knowing that some people marry prison pen pals reminds me that my life choices aren't all that bad. It happens. You see it. You see the stories. I don't know why people do this, but they do. 
Like, I don't know why I don't, I don't know why you start doing it in the first place. Like, it's just not a, I don't, whatever. Do whatever you want. I don't care. Birth strikers. Meet the women who refuse to have children until climate change ends. Victory! <laughs> it's kind of funny how, like, the the protesters out there, the boycotters, the, I'm not going to have kids until I, the climate. It's like, okay, well, that just means your dumb ideas die with you. Like, okay, I don't think anyone cares if you're going to do it. Go ahead. Say, like, the same with the ones that put their hands on the street. Like, you're not changing anyone's mind. To, to for you. You're changing your mind, minds against you. No one wants to be associated with your insanity. But anyways, this is why they're funny. This is why these people are hilarious. I love these people. I do. They are comedy gold. I'm always surprised when heavily tattooed couples have a baby and it comes out blank. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know that ink generally passes through the womb. It's a miracle. They should make a movie like Oppenheimer about the guy who invented this thing. <laughs> I'd watch that. How did you think of that? What, what, you know, why did you bring this evil into the world? This is needed nowadays. Nudes are overrated. Send me a video of you reading out loud so I know you're not effing stupid. <laughs> yeah. Some of you, all of you out in the dating pool right now, I really feel bad for you because you got to take a lot of precautions out there. A, check for the pronouns. B, you know, then make sure they're not dumb. You know. The zoo is a pretty safe place to fart. <laughs> Poops my pants in the gift shop. Ha <laughs> damn elephants. Come on. Grow up, Jake. Grow up. When the cashier asks if you'd like to make a donation to the poor. You know, I'm something of a poor myself. <laughs> yeah, stop asking at the cash registers. You work at Subway, stop asking for a tip. You work at the, the grocery store, stop asking to donate money. People are struggling across the board. Stop. Painting my chicken coop. Egg production tripled in only three days. All you chicken owners out there, there's a there's something for your toolbox. So about the wedding cards I gave out four months ago, kindly erase Alice and put Ruth. Same day, same venue. Is that real? That might be real. Um, I guess you gotta you know work with what you got. And keep all right. The type of sandwich I'm gonna make my husband at two a.m. Is your husband Scooby-Doo? Seriously. Dude, look at that sandwich. No, you don't do... We already went over this in this episode. You eat the shredded cheese and the ham on its own. Maybe wrap the pickle in the ham. You don't need this. 2 a.m.? Serious? I think they forgot to bite your apple. You got a knockoff there or what? Kind of a weird, interesting observation. But yeah, the apple uh, is supposed to have a bite out of it, isn't it? The first 50% of a book is longer than the last 50%. Don't ask me to explain. Yeah, you know, they're setting up the plots, the characters. Then it just speeds up because you get sucked into it. This makes sense if you, it, you know, for all of you non-readers out there, you wouldn't get it. You breaking down. Your kids, can I have a snack? <laughs> Parents, can you relate to this one, huh? When the boat across the lake hooks onto a big one. <laughs> Dude, I just, just did this a couple weeks ago. All of a sudden, I see his, his you know, rods bending over. You don't want to be a, a jerk about it, but got to see what he's catching. Maybe see what he's using for bait or for, for bait and a hook. And is he using a bobber? What's it, what's the situation over there? That's why if you do hook onto one, you kind of got to make sure you're turned away from other anglers so they don't see because screw them. Arizona AC units be like, we need a vacation. Working overtime. Thought about this the other day. I feel like if I lived in a place that got really hot, I'd have two. Just, you know, you got to have a backup just in case because there would be nothing worse than one going down and trying to sleep in 90 degree heat. Couldn't do it. If I'm passing you on the right, you're an idiot. This needs to be on every vehicle out there. How are you driving on the left going the speed limit? What are you doing? What's wrong with you? Who taught you how to drive? Do not mow. That sign's there because someone tried to mow that. We know this. Up until 1913, Americans kept all of their earnings. Despite this, America still had schools, roads, colleges, vast railroads, subways, and an army and a navy. Tell me again why taxes are necessary. Ah. 
The history of income tax. Look that one up. That's a good one. Used to be 1% at uh, 1913. And it was supposed to be temporary to fund the war. But we know that didn't happen. What are we paying now? Almost 30% federal? Mm, it's crazy. I have to go to work every day. I don't. Fair enough. But you also don't have any money. Neither do you. <laughs> Smarter than monkeys, are we? I don't, I don't know, man. What's it like having a teenage boy, you ask? My 14-year-old son just ate 52 pizza rolls and just asked me what's for dinner. <laughs> Oh, dude, this was us. My mom would go buy like $500 in groceries and it would be gone within a week. I it was just like this. Whoever got to the pizza rolls first went one. And you guys have heard that story. For those of you that haven't hear, heard it, here it is. Just kidding. I'm not going to put you through that. This guy's ruining this influencer's Photoshop is my new favorite thing. If you ever see an influencer out in the wild, do this. Ruin their photo. Destroy it by making stupid faces, getting in the shot, you know? Mock them. Me and my buddy ordering from the cart girl for the seventh time, like. <laughs> we got any cart girls watching? I'm sure you see this every time you work. The boys having a tough round, you know? So instead of trying to better their game and focus, they just have another beer and it ends in a disaster. Mamas, don't let your babies grow up to be the people who stand up as soon as the plane lands. Good reminder, worst type of people, how to properly store firewood. Jeez. I feel like that's just extra work, man. Nah. Chopping wood and stacking it is already enough work. What? Like, uh, you can do that if you want, but we try to impress, man. Goth girls, their shoes. <laughs> never understood that one either. I never understood the whole goth thing, like... Maybe it's the same thing as the, the pronoun thing these days, trying to be different and sticking out and, you know, going against the status quo per se. I, I don't know. I just, I've never got it. Does any, can anyone explain? Dude, don't you think you've had enough pockets? <laughs> That's so dumb. <laughs> if student loan forgiveness was a person. It shouldn't even be funny, but that's hilarious because that's perfect. What do you think you'll be doing in your golden years? Me. Dude, that's Dave. That's Dave right there. He's going to be doing this for the rest of his life. Sitting there watching reruns of The Office, probably quoting it word for word for every episode. Project car. My job trying to fund it. Everyone needs a hobby, man. Cars. People love cars. It's a pretty popular one. Fix your car. I love it. That's a great hobby. Spendy sometimes could be spendy not to sound old but hearing that blues clues now uses email for mail time and a smartphone instead of a handy dandy notebook almost broke me you know I never never got into this I was a little bit too old for this when it came out I watched it though because our little brother that was about his age so you know it is a little heartbreaking to see that because it was a classic it was people loved it sorry I can't hang out tonight I've got to work out study Crying can help you lose weight, and the best time to cry is from 7 to 10 p.m. Who's who's writing this crap? Don't do that. That's not going to help you lose weight. YouTuber. But before that, I want to thank today's spot. <laughs> Flash forward 15 seconds, me. We don't really have sponsors on this channel, um, unless you want the flag behind me. Old Glory Russell Stein. Go get one. But other than that, we don't really do sponsors. We kind of promote our own channels and stuff like that instead. That being said, I do watch a couple channels that do this, and I do the same thing. I fast forward through the paid sponsorship every single time. And here's the problem with those is generally the people that are paying the channels to do the paid sponsorship, they want it to be 60 seconds long. Like, that's a really long ad. Like, screw you. That's why I don't do them. That's why I don't do the paid sponsorship ads on this channel. 60 seconds, kiss my A. Girls on a first date. I hope he's marriage material. I hope our star signs match. Guys on a first date. I hope she shows up. I hope she's not a man. <laughs> See, again, back to what I said earlier. I feel really bad for you if you're out in the dating world because this is, this is what you have to, like the, the landmines you have to come across. A long time ago, an engineer decided he hated children and wanted to watch them burn. Been going to a lot of parks recently. 
with our daughter and, and Dee's kids. There's some dangerous toys out there, some dangerous playground equipment. This is one of them. Somehow in this crazy life, we found each other. Aren't you sisters? Is that a real post? How? Like, I just can't, I can't do it anymore, man. I can't handle it. Rollback was $88, now $99. Binomics, man, there it is, explained right there. Total burning ban, no campfires. Don't even fart out there. It's pretty dry this summer, it is. So, no farting out there. Let's start a fire. My teacher told me nobody would ever pay me to look out a window. He was wrong. He was wrong and you're probably doing pretty good. You, got, you really gotta work to live a healthy lifestyle on the road. It, you know, sit in a truck all day and whatnot. But it's possible and you make some pretty good money. So anyone that needs a job, that's not a bad idea. So your teachers are wrong. Pretty sure you can get a CDL at like 18, 19 years old. When you don't know how to do body work, but you're really good at roofing. Somebody out there said, hey, let's do, let's do something dumb. Let's, uh, instead of painting this old rusty bastard, let's put shingles on it. And I love it. I love this. You know what? Walt Disney presents Bambi. <laughs> Coming to a Disney movie near you. They're losing lots and lots and lots of money. Like millions and millions of dollars on their movies in the last couple years. I don't know how they don't realize what they're doing is dumb and people don't like it. But nevertheless, wouldn't be surprised if we saw this one at some point. Discuss. <laughs> oh no, don't do that. How are you going to get him off? Well, I guess you could drive away. If Once it starts, you back up. But... <sighs> I don't know, dude. I don't do that. I wish I loved anything as much as Jeep owners love telling everyone they're Jeep owners. The Jeep cult, man. Love those cars. Love them. Great vehicles. But there's a weird, a weird religion that surrounds them. That's just a fact. This is an actual road in Door County, Wisconsin. Uh, I think we had this a long time ago, but to reiterate, you know, instead of making a straight line... Leave it to Wisconsin to screw it up and go all the way, you know, in and out and in and out. Nice work, Wisconsin. Nice one. If Korean pop is K-pop, that means Chinese rap is crap. French art. <laughs> Fart? <laughs> play well. Play fast. Play poorly. Play faster. This has to be at every golf course. Some of you out there, you freaking suck and you try too hard and you take 10 practice swings each shot and you take 10 shots a hole. Enough when your buddy thinks he's going to beat you to the fishing hole. Not today, sucker. Not today. <laughs> Don't forget your plugs out there, boys. You're going fishing. Don't forget the plugs. Hey, everyone. The government just confirmed aliens are real. See? Nobody cares. Literally, nobody cares. It's just, like, I would, I would feel like at least, like, Half of people would care. Like at least half, but nobody at all. Zero. Zero people care. Binomics explained. We got another one. Look at this. Was 368, now 438. How is like these have to be fake? I don't believe that these are really in stores. Maybe. But this is the perfect explanation of Binomics. It truly is. The cartoon, the original movie, the Disney adaptation, Netflix. I love this. Uh, I think we've had the first three before, but you add Netflix on there. This is what Netflix does. So accurate. All of it. PETA, you're a bad parent if you feed your kids dairy ice cream. Biden likes ice cream, so that makes you fascist. <laughs> everything. Everything bad makes you a fascist, makes you, you know, extremist. So, of course, PETA, you are extreme. You're fascist. Right-wing crazies. I can't believe you said that. Wow. Biden likes it. Nuts. How would you do in today's video? Did you laugh at all? If you did, you got to go grab your pony and enter the next competition. It is what it is. Let me know how you did down in the comments. While you're down there, please like this video. Please help us get it recommended to others. That's it for today's video. Until next time, I'm Tyler Zed, and this is Education. 12, 15, oops, stepping on them. There's a, it's black, anyway. Idiots.